Hello, I'm here for an interview. Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. I am an English being created purely to ask questions to fictional characters. Here I will be talking to one of the King's siblings from the third and final book in the Cain Chronicles, The Serpent's Shadow. Hey. Pleasure to see you again, Carter. A lot has happened since the last time we spoke. Yeah. Sorry, I'm still kind of taking things in. I understand. Would you care to explain what has happened in the past year or so? Uh, yeah. I guess that's why I'm here after all. By the way, I don't know if it's just me, but you seem kind of different. You are in fact correct. I have been modified in order to produce better interviews. I did not like the previous outcome. I've got so many questions, but whatever. Let's get this over with. Okay. Our story starts. Can start you describe the central conflict and how it affected you and your sister, Sadie? You know what? Yeah. Yes, I can. Just for you, pal. I'm waiting. Fair enough. We've stalled long enough, you know. Basically, the whole gist of the story is that Apophis, the giant snake out of chaos, you know, is actually risen now and is going to swallow the sun and end the world and all that jazz. Just like last time. Except he's for sure out of his prison in the Duat. And attacks are happening all over the world. We lost a lot of magicians. Uh, anyways, the other part is Sadie, my sister, Walt, and Zia, complicated, uh, and I plan to execrate him from existence with an ancient spell. That part kind of took a while. And overall, how might you rate this journey on a scale of 1 to 10? 10. No explanation. I'm assuming we'll sort of cover that with your question. Now, for good questions. How did your magical abilities evolve throughout this book? Or, I meant to say journey, not book. What's a book? You're not in a book. It's fine. I know this is a school project. But, to answer your question, uh, my magic abilities only really changed at the end, just before it was time to fight Apophis. Is, uh, yeah, as we were coming out of the duop, the sun god himself, slash, Sia, my girlfriend, was hosting him. Gave me the authority to use the crook and flail, which um, I left. I didn't feel like bringing it in here. Uh, anyways, he gave me the authority to use those instruments and actually become Pharaoh of the gods. I'm still, and you know, it's been a, basically a week since, but I'm still trying to. You know, grasp my hands around the idea that... Thank you for the interview, Carter. You may not leave. Okay, just like last time, you want me to... just... dip out of here again? Have fun in your...